Hello ladies, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with a Kos haul. Kos and many other brands are currently making a lot of sales and that's why I decided that I want to finally exchange my wardrobe that is merely, that mostly consists from H&M, Zara and Man clothing pieces with high street clothing pieces from Kos, Massimo Duty and other stories and all that and just have a more better quality clothing pieces in my wardrobe rather than clothing pieces that are lesser quality. I mean of course you can get good quality clothing pieces from Zara, Mango and all that brands but if you have bought clothing pieces from Cos or Massimo Duty or Cezanne and all that high street brands you will notice the big difference from the clothing pieces to the clothing pieces from I don't know the high street from the fast fashion brands, one of the fast fashion brands. All right, so let's start with this video. What I'm wearing here is the silk blouse, the silk printed blouse that I absolutely love when I saw it online. I just couldn't wait until it arrived. And when it arrived, I took it out of the packaging and ripped the packaging apart to just finally try this blouse on. And this blouse looks so beautiful on. I absolutely love the print of it. It's, it has like this abstract, I would call it kind of abstract kind of prints going on. It has this color of brown, gray, black, beige going on and has the buttons that are hidden. I absolutely love blouses or shirts where the buttons are hidden. I think it looks way better when the buttons are hidden rather than when the buttons are visible. But of course, it depends on how you like wearing a blouse. And I like my blouses when the buttons are hidden. And it has like these buttons that are in a similar material and similar color. It looks so beautiful. I honestly am so glad that I could still get my hands on this blouse. On this beautiful silk blouse it feels really comfortable on um, very beautiful and what i did here is i paired it with this high waisted i think it's a high waisted trolley because it's quite high waisted on me it covers my belly button so it reaches up to my belly button and in this kind of a khaki color but the only problem with this is it is quite big it's cut quite big ladies I know I make a lot of hauls and I show a lot of clothing pieces but I'm hoping to help you ladies with my videos to know what to get, what sizing to get, and what to avoid and so on and I can see with this trouser it is cut quite big and on the website when I was purchasing it of course I'm always trying to see what size the model is wearing, is she wearing a small and how tall is she, is her figure similar to mine and I think she was wearing a size small online I was 1 meter 79 or so ish and I'm 1 meter 73 so 5 8 plus ish and let me tell you this trouser is just way too big I had to like use a clip here at the back if you can see it to like tighten up the trouser around the waist a little bit so I can actually show you how it looks from this video <laughs> otherwise it will be falling off and I will be standing here without any pants on you can just see the good quality of this trouser and the silk blouse it's just such a big difference to Zara Mango, Hitchin, and so on I mean ladies I think if you have bought clothing pieces from Zara and all the brands and I bought clothing pieces from Kos and Massimo Duty and so on you can see the difference and you can feel the difference the difference are really very obvious and I won't get this blouse a size smaller a size bigger I would just recommend for you to keep this blouse in your regular size with the pants you will definitely need to size down one or two sizes next we have this oversized button-down shirt that I should have bought in my regular size but because it was written oversized and the model was also quite tall and I'm not a big fan of the really oversized um, shirts and very very oversized look on me personally I decided to get it a size smaller and that was a big mistake I mean if you can see it here already you can see that it is just so small I have quite long arms and it just don't reach down to my um, hand is yeah 
It's just a, quite a piece missing. What I've already ordered this is a size bigger. Gladly, it was still available. I have a similar cotton button up shirt from H&M and you cannot compare the quality to each other. This one just totally feels different on. It just feels like it's made of a really good high quality material. So this one is quite long and yeah, as you can see, it has like cuts on the side. It has buttons that are visible, but yeah, as I mentioned before, I love it when the buttons are more hidden. That's just what I love on me personally. But otherwise, this is just a beautiful, let's say, regular button down shirt that shouldn't be missing anyone's wardrobe. And I just really love the length of it. So you're able to do a lot of styles with this kind of length. And I won't consider it really oversized. It's not that fitting, but I will call it, it's quite a regular shirt that doesn't look so oversized if you don't get it as bigger than your regular size. So what I did here, as I mentioned, is I got this a size smaller, but I've gladly ordered it a size bigger so i would recommend you to purchase this shirt in your regular size if you don't want it to be too oversized but if you want it to be more oversized then get it a size bigger than your regular size or even two size bigger than your irregular size as you can see i'm also wearing it with the same trouser that i showed you before with the silk blouse and also it just matched together it just this, this trouser just go with so many clothing pieces and that is just what i love about calls is that they're clothing pieces are very interchangeable there are pieces that you can keep in your wardrobe for a very long time and they are very easy to style and combine with each other they do not really have very very crazy colors and crazy styles they have like moderate style that i think is comfortable for a lot of people to wear so because i'm the type of person i don't really like wearing crazy styles i want to wear clothing pieces and i really feel comfortable wearing when i go out the door and i would consider my style to be more feminine i have a very feminine style i have clothing pieces in my wardrobe that are very feminine and also I have clothing pieces in my wardrobe that are a little bit more masculine but when I'm dressing up I always try to mix my feminine clothing pieces into my masculine and just merge them together so all right now this blouse that i'm having on is called the oversized grandel color blouse and again because i thought it was quite oversized and the model was also i think a little bit taller that's why i decided to purchase this a size smaller because again i don't want my clothing pieces to be so oversized the oversized clothing pieces are in my opinion just a current trend and i don't want to have clothing pieces in my wardrobe that are considered as trends and then after one or two years these trends are no longer trendy and you have like this oversized clothing pieces in your wardrobe that isn't trending anymore so this again is not really oversized in my opinion so it's not that fitting that it's like hugging your silhouette it's let's say just a tight bit begging so i decided to purchase this a size smaller again because it was considered oversized online and it is quite tight here my movements are quite restricted and again the arms are also not that long that it reaches down to my hands I will be purchasing this a size bigger again if it's still available. What I'm hoping for, I'll try to link everything down in the description box below and I hope that a lot of these pieces are still available. A lot like this is also not just easy to style during the summer season, it's also easy to style in all the other seasons. So let's say for winter, spring or fall, you can just wear a knit sweater over it or you can wear like a roller top under it and there's also another way for you to style this kind of blouse or button down shirt kind of different ways i just find that the sizing is sometimes so inaccurate on their website and i think if um they would try to make the clothing pieces more accurate it would be much environmentally friendly for the people purchasing the clothing pieces because they will not be getting a lot of clothing pieces sent back here finally something that is not too small and also not too big just fits perfectly on and it's this linen button-down shirt that just feels 
so beautiful on. So this is made out of 100% linen and I can totally feel the difference between a linen blend shirt and yeah, lesser quality linen. This feels really nice on. The color is kind of a cream color rather than a white color. And it's also quite long. We have a pocket here, has the button. I love to tuck in my shirts or wear them out. And this one is also just a shirt that you can just easily just have this easy going style going on just wear it out or you tuck it in or you tie it up and it's also really nice to have an oversized quite a little bit oversized shirt like this in your wardrobe especially if you're going swimming and you just need a cover up i think this would also be great as a cover up and I got this a size bigger than my regular size. Yes, I got this in the size 38 rather than size 36. And I'm really glad I did because if I would have gotten this in a size 36, it would have been too small. And with this like this, it's just, it reaches down to my hands and it's also a little bit longer and yeah fits on nicely. I saw this online on the model, she was wearing it with red leg jeans that I tried on in my jeans haul and it looks so fabulous together. I just love the entire look that she was going on, also with the high heel shoes that I also gladly got my hands on. I'm going to be showing you later on and these two style together with the long straight jeans and this long shirt just looks so beautiful together. That's why I decided to purchase this shirt. The beautiful thing about this shirt are the arms. It is kind of flared out like bells. So you definitely need to get this two sizes bigger. If you have long arms like I do, you will need to get it two sizes bigger just for you to be able to have it long enough to reach your hands and also wide enough for you to be able to style it the way you want it to look and yeah so i'm glad that i purchased this this time in a size large because the first time when i purchased this shirt i purchased it in a size small and let me tell you it was just way too small it felt like an extra small on me and i think the model on the website again was wearing the size small and i really think by this time is there surely or maybe really just copy and pasting it into their other clothing pieces that they're all wearing the size small and i just can't believe that get this the size for it's so bigger than your regular size Ladies, you need to go ahead and watch my jeans haul to get information about these jeans. Honestly, everything looks much better on with heels. With all heels, I just feel like a pressed sausage in these jeans because they're quite tight around my thighs. So go and watch my jeans haul if you're interested in these jeans. This is exactly how the model wore it online. And that is the reason I bought these denim jeans as well as this shirt and the shoes because I just love how she looks with this outfit online. But on me, I kind of like it, but just the jeans, they just look way too tight. Now the lighting might have changed in the video right now because I had to turn on the lighting. It's just gotten so dark in here and it's just not even noon yet. All right, so the next shirt that I'm wearing is called the Contrast Silk Panel Shirt that I was super excited to try on because I just love how it looked on the model again. Also, if she was just wearing a tank top underneath and had this like kind of open. But I do not own something like this in my wardrobe and I just want to have clothing pieces in my wardrobe as well that are just a little bit extra just looks a little bit different than other regular shirts and yeah so it has this silk like sheer detailing going on at the front that is see-through and you need to take care of what you're wearing on your knee but otherwise it has like this cotton detailing going around here the arms cuffs hem and the upper back and here at the collars as well and otherwise it's just made out of this silk material that just looks really lovely on so i'm wearing this in the size 36 and at the first time when i tried it on i thought it looked just too big and i wanted to get a size smaller but now that i'm looking at it again i just think it's the perfect size and i won't get this a size smaller yeah 
I just love how it looks, how flow it is, how airy it is, and also that you're able to style it multiple different ways. It's very uh, appropriate for the summer season right now, but it's also great to wear in the winter season with a cashmere roll neck top or just a cashmere top underneath. It don't need to be a roll neck or whatsoever. I'm just trying to give you some inspiration of what you can style this way. You can wear a knit vest over it. I love the fit of it as well. It looks a little bit oversized, but Depends on the way you like to style it. Yeah, definitely going to keep it with a real of the way it looks on me. I love that I will be able to style it with pants like this, with denim jeans, shorts, and skirts. Just going to look really beautiful. Did I say that you should get this in your regular size? So please do not size up with this one. I got this in my regular size, size 36. And it just fits on oversized, and I think a size bigger would have just been way too big. So keep this in your regular size. This shirt here, I was so upset when I took it out of the packaging and tried it on, and I noticed that it's just too, too tight. I got this again. In my regular sizes, yes, I did get this in my regular size. So yeah, it's called the Relaxed Fit Tailor Shirt. And because it was called the Relaxed Fit Tailor Shirt, I thought this is going to be also a little bit too oversized. That's why I decided to get it just in my regular size. Honestly, it's so confusing to know what sizing to get when you're purchasing the clothing pieces on this website. I think, I mean, I'm going to have a Massimo Duty haul after this one. And their sizing is even more often called sizing or any other brand that I've tried on so far. So this one I'm wearing in a size 36 and it is just too tight, very uncomfortable to move in and the arms are very restricting so very annoying but uh, what I love about this shirt mostly is the back detailing, this detailing here I just find it to look so fabulous it just doesn't give you that regular shirt that just looks very regular it just gives you that extra on your shirt that just makes your outfit looks a little bit more chic Honestly, there is some plans for filming this video. I have so many words planned, like other words I want to use. But when standing in front of the camera, I just get like this total brain fog and I can't remember what I want to say. And that's why you hear me saying most of the time, oh, it's so chic, it's so classy. I mean, I know that there are other words out there that I can use, but that are just the words that mostly comes into my mind and into my mouth that just goes out faster than anything else I can think about. Yeah, so let's continue with this shirt. So this shirt has hidden bottom detailing that I absolutely love. You know that already. So there aren't any pockets at the front. So what else do we have? So as I mentioned, the arms are quite tight and restricting, but gladly I purchased this top already in size bigger than my regular size, but again, I don't want it to be too oversized. And I think a size bigger would just look the way I want it to look. Another thing that I decided to purchase is this silk cardigan. It is very beautiful khaki color, dark khaki color with white stripes going on and this color is very very complementing to my skin tone. I just love how this color complements my skin tone and overall it has buttons in the same color. Very lovely. Love that. So ooh, I'm wearing it in a size small and it fits on a little bit oversized. It has a deep V neckline, so it fits on a little bit oversized. You can see that the white line is also here around the arm, but going on, going on in the inner part of the arm. And this silk cardigan, it's a silk cardigan, feels on very nicely, very comfortable. And I just love how it sits and it feels on me. It feels like it's giving my skin enough space to breathe. You may have maybe noticed that this video is kind of a relaxed video, not too much editing going on here. So you will see me popping the videos, the full outfit here on the left or on the right side. You're probably seeing it already, but I just want to mention it again. I just want to see if you ladies also like this type of videos. Just also let me know that in the comment section below. I'm always happy to read your comments, ladies. So if this cardigan is still available, I would recommend you ladies to get this cardigan. It looks really nice on. And I can't even wait to style this silk cardigan with a nice roll neck cashmere top underneath or with a, with a roll neck top in a similar color to go with the whole entire monochrome look that looks so shit.
magic. Another item that I purchased is this V-neck wool vest that I do not own anything similar like this in my wardrobe. I just don't know why. I'm just purchasing something like this now. I've never felt like a person that would thought that something like this would look good on me. And I'm so glad that I purchased this because I love the way it looks on me. It is more of a relaxed look. I got it a size bigger than my regular size. I'm wearing this in a size medium. And this is definitely something you should get one or two sizes bigger than your regular size. If you're a type of person that would love to wear like chunky knits underneath and maybe oversized button down shirts underneath, then you should definitely get this a size or two sizes bigger. But it's also cut a little bit quite bigger than let's say other knits vest and it also fits a little bit loosely on the skin, on the body and yeah, otherwise we do not have a lot of details going on here. But it is in a really beautiful cream beige color. So, and next we have this chunky knit vest that feels a little bit rougher than the other knit vest that I tried on. And yeah, and this is also kind of a little bit more cropped and smaller. I'm wearing this in a size medium. So and it doesn't feel that chunky on at all. It feels kind of cropped. So it just ends right above my waist. Just like right above my waist. So it's not that oversized. So I'm really glad I got this a size bigger. I would have even went for a size bigger. So two sizes bigger than my regular size. And yeah, so it has this knitted detailing going on. It also feels a little bit more rough as I've mentioned than the other one, but otherwise it feels quite comfortable on. And yeah, styling this knit vest with a black straight leg or flat or denim jeans or trouser will look so so good and it also looks really good with this khaki pants on. As I mentioned, this khaki pants just complements everything in my wardrobe. Alright, this knit vest, you probably saw it in another color in my summer haul as well and I had to purchase it in this black color. I love this knit vest so much. They look so good on. You can style it so many different ways and oh, I just love it so much just looks very nice on. For some reason, this high neck just feels different than the high neck on the white knit vest. On the nice white knit vest, it just feels more chunkier, more bigger. And on this black one, it just don't feel like that. It just feel much more loosely and comfortable to wear it this way. So with the white knit vest, I wore it this way like this. So I wore it like this more, like I turn it inwards and to just have it a little bit more comfortable but honestly this black one i would wear like this but i think with the white one i was just scared to get my makeup on it and that's why i turned it more inward but yeah a really beautiful knit vest that i can imagine having in my wardrobe for many years and even giving to my kids in future <laughs> because it's just the type of classic clothing piece that i think that can last in a wardrobe and that will still look in the next 10 or 20 years and this just comes in only one size one size fits all and i think it's quite accurate if you have a little bit of a wider shoulder i think the shoulder might be a little bit too short for that so you can see here like this i find the shoulders to be a little bit cut smaller i find this black one to even fit a little bit smaller and tighter around this place than the white one i just don't know maybe i gained a little bit of weight i don't know but yeah ladies you will always see me wear my nude bra underneath when i'm filming i mostly only just wear a nude bra because that just goes with everything how i had my finger crossed for this dress to be available and in my sizing as well because the first time when I checked out on this dress it was not available in my sizing and I was so sad and gladly it was available in my size after a couple of days and I had to grab it and buy it immediately before I go out of stock again and ladies <laughs> this looks so beautiful on I love this detailing this ruffle detailing that is going on around the arms and here around the neck it looks so so flattering on it is a very feminine and alluring dress because it is and fits quite tight on it pops the silhouette and just looks very beautiful on and yeah it also has the rough detailing on the bottom part going on it has a very minimal slit on the side and i think minimal slit on the side to so just show your legs a little bit looks way more alluring and way more alluring and seductive 
smooth than a skirt or a dress that has a very high slit and honestly are you more comfortable with a skirt or a dress that has a very very high slit that you're actually needing to take care that your underwear or your booty your bum isn't showing or with just a minimal slit on the side that just shows but let me show a little bit but not so much and that is just what i absolutely love and i feel much more comfortable with a small slit on the side rather than a big slit this dress is also very simple true so mind what you're wearing underneath so the size i'm wearing is in the size extra small small and the size medium large would have been way too big because this dress is quite stretchy what i don't really like about this dress just one minimal detailing is that it just doesn't fall that nicely it has this um I'm not quite sure what it's called, but I will show you what I mean. So this one here that is, yeah, I don't find it to look so flattering, but otherwise I think it just depends on what kind of person is wearing it on and how your body is shaped. This is a really beautiful dress and definitely worth buying now for the colder season. And also because it's not that thick, it's not out of a thick material, I would also wear this in the cold summer nights, so date or a girls night out and it is just such a beautiful and complimenting dress. And I can't believe it, I almost forgot about this blouse because I've worn it a couple of times now since I purchased it because it just looks so flattering on. I love that the arms are not quite long, the reaches till the elbow and they're kind of puffed up. They are in this cotton material and the color is a navy color if you can decide you should get the clothing piece in a black color or in a navy color i would say consider getting it in a navy blue color because you probably already have a lot of clothing pieces in your wardrobe that are black and navy blue color are in my opinion as something that are a little bit more sophisticated looking because you do not see a lot of people wearing navy blue we all rather go for black clothing pieces right and with this blouse here we have hidden buttons what i love it is in the perfect size so i got this in my regular size and it just fits on very perfect and nicely on i love the length of it i love the fit of it it's not restricting around the arms at all it doesn't feel restricting here as well at the shoulders just overall just sits very nicely on my silhouette this blouse i'm pairing it with this flared knitted trouser in this beautiful black color together with navy looks very very chic on i should have went up a size with this trouser because it fit quite tight around my thighs and around my waist i would consider it to be just all right just fits on perfectly but around the thighs they are quite a bit tight is it uncomfortable not really but i would have loved it a little bit more looser on my legs on my thighs and i just think i gained a little bit of weight and that's it they had slits on the back that just gives a little bit extra to these trousers and yeah i love the material it's made out of and it is also quite stretchy but not too stretchy so it's just mediocre stretching and it goes so well with this navy blue blouse and i just love the look of it together with the heels that i bought from cos a very chic and sophisticated looking outfit that i'll be wearing very often as i've worn this blouse with the denim trouser with the denim jeans and also with the denim with denim shorts as well as with a um, slit skirt i tried that on as well now let's talk about these fabulous shoes that i had to purchase Oh my goodness, when they were on sale, I was, I had to drop everything and just run over and like purchase this, these shoes. They are so beautiful, very feminine, very seductive, alluring, you name it. I really love it. I just think it looks so beautiful on. Is it the most comfortable shoes? No, not really but they are not so comfortable. I bought one shoe from Zara and they were kind of in a similar silhouette. They are red and have like this um, detailing showing going on. You might have saw it in one of my other videos. And yeah, this one, they feel medium comfortable. I would say from between one and 10, I would say it's a 7.5 on the comfortability. And 
they look really nice on so i've got this in my regular size and it fits on perfectly i got these loafers these white loafers that are very 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 comfortable that you can also wear like slippers because you can tongue the back inwards and just wear it like slippers they are so beautiful so comfortable and this and because they're white they also go with a lot of my neutral clothing pieces in my wardrobe but they also go with of course with colorful clothing pieces as well and i love how it looks they look very minimalistic but very classy please i really enjoyed filming this video for you today and also other other videos and if you like to present myself and you like my videos and you've seen yourself watching these videos of mine regularly and you haven't still subscribed, I'd really love for you to subscribe to my channel. So ladies, make sure to subscribe and like this video and subscribe to my channel. And I will hopefully see you in my next video. Thank you so much. And one other thing, ladies, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. If you're on Instagram, I'd really love to have you follow me on there as well. And I will see you next time, ladies. Thank you so much and goodbye.